Islam has that fight against Drew Dober coming up. What are kind of your expectations for him in that upcoming fight? Well, unfortunately for him on this fight, Drew Dober is such an incredibly tough guy, but he's not expected to be a huge challenge for him because of the ranking. And uh, a win for Islam is not going to bring his stock up too high when, in fact, you know, a uh, win against RDA would have really moved his stock up in this particular situation. We might even have a tougher guy, but not ranked higher. So it's one of those scenarios where he's going to get through it and he's going to do great, but he belongs in fighting the top five in the world. That's where Islam belongs, in my opinion. Yeah, and speaking of that top five, he's ranked 14 right now, but a lot of people kind of see him or view him as already, you know, one of the top contenders in that lightweight division. So when you look at the top, you know, five, top eight uh, lightweights in the world right now, how do you think that Islam kind of matches up uh, against them? He matches up great with all of them. And listen, this is, uh, there's no secret. I've always said, uh, when people talk to me about Habib sparring, and I say he's never lost a sparring session ever in the history of sparring with me, never. And I'd say he does lose a round here and there. And the one thing that I've never said, who? <laughs> and the person who is Islam. He's the only one that's ever won a round against Habib, ever, ever, yeah. ever. He's the only one that's ever done it. No one's ever beat Habib in a round, never. And all the years I've, I've, he's been with me, the nine years, no one's ever beat him in a round, never. So if Islam is winning a round here and there, yeah. how good is Islam? Oh, absolutely. And I know all the fans can't wait to see him uh, in that octagon in March. So what are kind of your expectations for him and maybe in 2021? You know, I think 2021 is the because Habib's got such a high profile name and, and now that he's potentially retired we don't know 100 percent all eyes are going to be in islam who's next from eagles mma and uh and we obviously we know our top dog right now from eagles is is, is islam so all eyes are going to be on him his cousin umar uh his cousin ushman who's with the bellator you know uh, abukar and then uh, uh all eyes are going to be on, on Zub zubaira you know all because they're all part of that click you know and uh they named me the head coach for team eagle so i'm the head coach for all those guys so i'm going to be involved with all those guys you know in their fights and uh it looks like a very good year for us but i think this fight is not going to be the coming out for islam i think the next one is yeah it's only because not that drew drew is not super super tough is he's just not ranked mm -hmm. you know in the top five <laughs>